scroll down a bit. Let's um, let's look at this pipeline shape here, Gary. The, the funnel. Yeah, the funnel. What's your view about this chart? Well, I I think it can be informative. I think that the only thing I would say about it is it's very difficult to gauge just by looking at that funnel how yeah. much is in each section and. Without, that, the, without the numbers without the numbers and that's why we've put the numbers in yeah you know it's important to see those numbers it helps you get a real understanding of what's going on there but the shape of that chart is never going to change <laughs> even if you've got two million in investigation and two hundred thousand in prospecting it's still going to look like a funnel it's actually difficult without the numbers is that because it, it, it's because there's quite a lot more than the other sometimes when you've got values about similar it's quite difficult just with the naked eye to see whether the surface area of the graph is 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 different you might want and, to get your rulers out yeah indeed yeah um and um it, the, the shape of it and the size of it always stays the same so why why bother with it um why bother well i actually think it's a good chart to, i remember writing the blog post it's a good chart to look at once a week yeah and the reason i think it's a good chart to look at once a week is the the, the the pipeline we 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 want to understand in the total pipeline is it roughly in proportion so the chart above gives us an indication well how much what's the value of deals that we've got going forward what does the pipeline look like by stage going forward and this takes the total pipeline and tells us whether it's roughly in proportion now i would say that doesn't look too bad we've got 0.78 in investigation 1.77 um, that probably doesn't look too bad, but often when you when you look at a a, a funnel, look at, you look at a pipeline, you might find that the you know the evaluating, the investigation stage and so on, sometimes quite similar, or even we have less pipeline in the preceding stages, or maybe we've got less pipeline in the prospecting stage. So that at least tells me I need to do something. You've so got to take an action there. Yeah, I, exactly. Exactly. So, um, so in this case, it doesn't uh, look too bad. Um, and just as we were talking there, I noticed that um, the pipeline here for May, we've got a kind of dip in May. Now, maybe that's okay. Uh, is there some, you know, historical reason why that is? Should I be concerned about that? Only you know the answer to that in the context of your business. But again, it's starting to give you the information you need to ask the right questions and um, start to understand um, how much business you might have going forward.